Hello and welcome to Living Supernaturally. We hope you're having a great day. Uh, we're doing an exciting series called Daily Reminders. Of this, uh, it's a reminder of this simple truth that uh, just like how we have a checklist for our work, our study, maybe a shopping list, uh, it's good to have a checklist. In other words, to be reminded of certain things almost every day. Um, the psalmist says this in Psalm 103 and verse 2. He says, Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits. In fact, the psalmist is telling himself, Bless the Lord and forget not. Uh, he is choosing to remind himself to remember the wonderful things that God has done for him, all his benefits. So today, our daily reminder is that uh, we need to remind ourselves and remember that God has given us something wonderful, powerful. He has given us His authority. In Christ, He has given us His authority. Luke chapter 10 and verse 19, uh, the words of the Lord Jesus says, Behold, I give you the authority to trample on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy and nothing shall by any means hurt you. So what is the Lord saying here? He's saying to his disciples, to the followers of the Lord Jesus. So if you are a follower of the Lord Jesus, then it applies to you saying this, I give you the authority to trample on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy. So he's talking about the authority over the powers of darkness and over Satan and all his powers, whatever it could be, saying over all the power of the enemy, I give you the authority to, to trample upon it, which means to, to, uh, to overcome and dominate the power of the enemy. He's saying, I give you the authority. Ephesians 2 verses 5 and 6, even when we were dead in trespasses, uh, he made us alive together with Christ by grace, you have been saved and raised us up together and made us sit together in the heavenly places in Christ Jesus. So imagine this, this is the view or this is the position, this is the place that we have spiritually to be able to sit together uh, with Christ in the heavenly places, in Christ. This is the uh, privilege and the spiritual authority that we have. The Lord Jesus says in Mark chapter 16, verses 17 and 18, and these signs will follow those who believe. In my name, they will cast out demons. They will speak with new tongues. They will take up serpents, and if they drink anything deadly, it will by no means hurt them. They will lay hands on the sick, and they will recover. So the Lord Jesus is giving us His authority. He's giving us this delegate, he's delegating these authority and saying, you go and do these wonderful things in my name. So this is a reminder for us that God has given us his authority and authority we need to walk in. This authority, this kind of authority, uh, God's desire is that every believer, young and old, will choose to walk in this kind of authority and manifest Christ wherever we are. Shall we pray? Father, we thank you for this reminder that you have given us your authority, Lord, that we might walk in it, that our choices will be governed by it, that our life will be governed by, uh, by walking in such a kind of authority. And Lord, we pray that we would manifest your glory, that you would manifest your glory, God, even as we stand and speak and declare and reach out and pray, Lord, let your authority be mad made manifest in and through our lives. We thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.